Well, it's too wet to uh, be in the field mowing any hay, so I guess we're gonna stretch up woven wire and uh, one strand bio wire over here where we set those braces at last week. You can see the link, whichever side it is. I'll stack it up there for you guys. So when we set those H braces last week, um, the yearlings are gonna go over here to this lot. But in the meantime, we actually may string some poly wire and put some cows over here for a few days to eat it down. that but I guess we'll figure it out huh okay I wore gloves today you should be so proud this ground must be hot the struggle of finding the bubble wire Should not go anywhere, but I don't think I don't. I'll know. hold it. Y'all have knocked. That'd be awesome. Huh? That'd be awesome. Yeah, y'all have knocked me down with this crap before. Okay. Okay, you went to move in there. <laughs>
gotta get it, like, it's got a swivel ring. Yeah, okay, go. Tilt down. Tilt down. No, the other way. Tilt down. There you go. That's tilt up. No, it's not. Okay, one more. Just gonna make sure. Squeeze that like that. Squeeze. Squeeze down a little bit. I mean, not all the way, but get closer. No, no. Well, I can't see okay, your thumbs well, in Well, you need to look at the other side. So now that we've got the Stay Tough fence up in the bob wire, we will uh, put clips on it. Hmm. What do you think, Sky Girl? We use the woven wire as a parameter fence and then run high tensile through our paddocks. <laughs> you make editing such a pain. Well, I don't know when you're going to hit the button. Ah. Anyway, these are the age braces that we built a couple weeks ago, and I will put the video of us doing that right up here. But we are now going to finish stringing the woven wire and bob wire. Hop, oh, hop to it now. Yeah. Are you going to watch it? Or? Yeah, I'll watch it. Where'd my gloves go? Yeah. Good? Yep. Good? As of right now, yes. gonna end up following me back down. Come on, Gabs! 
I'll come back and feed you in a little bit. I'm gonna walk down the road. <sighs> it's so nice to finally have some warm sunshine today. It did rain, it's muddy. Uh, but, you know, can't have everything. This allows us to get some projects done before we get in the field hot and heavy. I've got cows I need to bring home and preg check. I've got some heifers that I need to, I'm walking with Ryder, so don't mind my craziness. Our ride's coming. Come on, come on. Almost there. better than this on a Friday night. Wrangler butts and cowboys. And gals! What are you doing? Look at this nosy little thing. Is it? Hmm. Favorite part of the night. Favorite part of the day, actually. Only thing that would be better is being on a horse and walking through all these guys. What do you think, 54? Hi, good mama. Hey, good mama. Where's our new baby? Okay. Yeah, so we do have the fall herd catty corner to our spring herd. So it's probably the closest you'll ever see them all together. Hello, Faithers. Hello, babies. What are you thinking, 34? Bull calf, bull calf, show me calf. Just like watching these guys move. These are my 30s. Well, that one's not. That one's a 48. And then all my spring herd is on one side. And my fall herd is right there. I think I've talked about it before, but like there's eight right there. That doesn't have a tag. She's right there. She has a tag. You just can't tell. So she has her daughter in from 2018 is in there. She's a first-time heifer. And then we still have left the steer in there. So eight's got her daughter and son. It looks like my rod just left me. My sink babies. <laughs> 